Mac, how far are those Russian ships from the blockade? They just moved to the 100 mile mark. Okay, in terms of time, Mr. are they. Mr. President, our sonars just picked up two Russian subs with SLBM capability escorting the ships. Okay, so if we, uh, if we stop their ships, they can retaliate. Retaliate with their subs, yes, sir. Khrushchev is just up the ante. Risking a confrontation 7,000 miles from Moscow. Gentlemen, can I uh, have your attention, please? Jack, State Department just received this from Khrushchev. Go ahead. Uh, you have not declared a quarantine, but rather have set forth an ultimatum and threatened that if we do not give in to your demands, you will use force. Naturally, we will not be uh, bystanders with regards to piratical acts by American ships on the high seas. We will be forced to take measures we consider necessary and adequate in order to protect our rights. And we have everything necessary to do so. Christ, calling us out. Yes, sir. And we cannot capitulate. If we don't stop those ships, our entire deterrent system loses all credibility. What are the, uh, what are the steps? We signal our intent to board. They don't acknowledge. We fire a warning shot across their bow. And, uh, they keep coming? And we take out their rudders and leave them dead in the water. Which runs a risk of killing Russian sailors. And a retaliation from cruise ships. It's the nature of conflict, sir. I know the nature of conflict, General. I've been in it. Mac? You have no choice but to stop those ships. Sir, I still believe a diplomatic solution is possible. That's just about the most meaningless thing I've ever heard, Dean. We're well beyond diplomacy at this point. Khrushchev is going to run the damn blockade. Sir, I agree with the Attorney General. We have to stop those ships. I recommend that we deploy helos and subseekers from Key West to stop the subs. Do you want to start World War III? It'll be the end of all life on the planet. Decisive action would surgically remove the missiles, confronting the world with a fait accompli. Let's not forget about the political advantage. Militarily, there's no option, sir. Punishment is no other alternative.